All right, what's up guys? Uh, so I wanted to make a quick video on what the secondaries look like in uh, my stove and pretty much any EPA stove. Every, all the videos that I see of people posting secondaries are whenever they've just got it absolutely blazing. And while that is secondaries, uh, it's important. One of the important things about these stoves is the fact that really you just need a hot stove to have secondaries. You don't have to have a big blazing fire. So right now I've got one kind of larger size ash split just sitting on top of some sycamore coals. And uh, I have already, I had the stove already up to temperature whenever I put the ash split in. I put it in maybe half hour ago or so. And uh, so right now it's pretty much all secondaries in there. I've got, I don't know if you can see, I've got the damper pretty much it's maybe five percent open it's pretty much closed um, and then here's the secondaries so I think you can have a very calm you know small controlled fire and still have great secondaries um, I don't have the blower going right now because it's like 40 degrees outside and just the heat from getting the stove up to temperature and then this one ash split with these nice secondaries, um, it puts out enough heat to heat the house. It's like 75 downstairs and 74 upstairs. But I just wanted to do a video kind of showing what these stoves can do, um, you know, as far as efficiency wise and really getting everything that you can out of a piece of wood rather than just show, you know, I mean the secondaries are impressive whenever you've got four or five splits in there and it's just going like crazy. But I think this is probably uh, really more what you ought to be shooting for. Um, just a hot stove and essentially just burning the smoke as it rises off your wood. So uh, anyway, hope that helps. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, subscribe. And I'll talk to you later.